Hey everyone, last week, last Tuesday, uh, I was in a Zoom meeting and someone asked me what the science project was behind me. <laughs> and it hadn't even dawned on me, I didn't even review the, uh, the humidifier that I got. Uh, I had a place on my back and the last time I went to the doctor, because it was itching like crazy, and she says, it's dry skin, and she gave me some cream for it. And uh, then when I started um, with the plants, I started looking at humidity. And it was like no humidity at all. And I'm like, no wonder my skin's dry. And I read up on it and everybody said, get a humidifier, etc., etc. I mean, I'm in Arizona. Everyone laughs and says, it's a dry heat. And it is. So anyway, I started off with smaller humidifiers, uh, which will do, I believe, uh, 500 square foot. And they were not making the humidity rise in the living room because I've got the living room, the kitchen, and the bathroom. Yeah, living room kitchen and the bathroom all in one area so yeah the little bitty one it just wasn't cutting it so I moved it to the bedroom and I found this one on Amazon and don't worry I'll put the link below it was on sale and it's a tower humidifier and it's quiet. It really is. But it comes with a remote control and it will put out some as you can see and that is on low. I mean, you can address your humidity, how much humidity you want, from like 50 all the way up to 95, which I have there, and uh, and there, that's actually looks like a, a fire. <laughs> But my humidity has already gone up 2%, 3, 4, 5, since I've been talking to you. I mean, it's gone up 5%. And this thing's got a uh, 120 days free exchange, one year quality assurance warranty on it. If y'all can hear me, I got all kinds of stuff going. It's a Hiswell. And it holds 4.5 gallons of water. And um, it's an ultrasonic. So it's not going to get warm. It's going to just put out like one of those... Uh, one of those um, diffusers with the scents in it. And it's got a place for a scent too, I think. I don't use it on there, but um, if you put it on maximum, it'll go 21 hours without you having to uh, add more water. And let's see, you can What else? You can go from 45 to 95 percent humidity uh, and set your target humidity. You can also put it on um, a timer. It's got a timer that you can add to it uh, or put it on. It can go intermittent miss different sections and it has a sleep. The sleep is so it knocks off the light 
and you wake up put it back on and uh, it's also got a UV light that I just turned on and that'll get rid of any uh, bacteria or anything like that there is no filter for it at all which is pretty cool because the other things I have have filter and I'll tell you what I'll do I just turned it off it comes with uh, this hose So it'll get up and over things, and it comes with this little short thing, which goes on this, this plate, and then puts, puts it on there. If that makes any sense. But it was on sale on Amazon. Not sure if it's still on sale or not, but I'll put the link down. You can check on it. Um, you fill it up. Let me get some light on this bad bear here. And there, you don't put it in the center because that's where the humidity is coming out. You put it in the sides and it goes down there. Let me show you what's inside. Take that off. It's so simple. But it has great reviews. There's absolutely nothing. When you raise it up, you kind of got to tilt it. I don't know if y'all can see down there underneath. That's like a a sump. And what will happen is, if it runs dry, it will shut itself off also. So that's a good thing. And of course, it's got its own humidifier or a humidity checker which is back over here that's that little box there to help you keep track of your humidity it's got wheels on it so you can roll it around just in case you're wondering and I prefer the pipe over this this you can adjust to point it one way but uh, I like the pipe to go over and I would also, if you get one, I would suggest that you use uh, um, distilled water. Because if you don't, you're going to end up with white dust all over the place. Don't know why, but it does it. You have to trust me on that. I know. I mean, I have white dust all over my TV, all over my lamps and everything. And then I found out it was from using uh, regular water. So I put filtered water in it and you still got it. So I used distilled water and I've had no problems. Also, I've had no problems with my plants growing. As you can see my uh, My sticky traps, I've got them on here. The reason I've got them is because I got uh, my elephant ear, elephant ear plant in, 
and uh, as soon as I put replanted it and used some of, had some of its soil and stuff, man, the gnats and everything else came out. That was no fun. So <laughs> I got the little traps and I got the insecticide, which is made out of plants also. So. They're going away, but it's all growing really good with this humidity. And my skin is not dry anymore. I can scrape my arm. Used to, you'd scrape my arm, and it would just turn white. Now you can scrape my arm, and it doesn't. It's, you know, and my back's not itching. I have no uh, dry skin, so... I'll put this, um, I'll put a link to it. And they've got other ones too. The only drawback which I would like to see is if you see that little water droplet, that's actually a window to see how much water you got in there. And all your controls, you can control them there as well. But you can see that little window down there, but there's no light in there. I would like to see a light that uh, where you could tell how much water, but with, you know, if you put four and a half gallons of water in there and you run it full blast, it'll last you 21 hours, like it says, or whatever, and it's supposed to be able to uh, humidify 2,000 square foot. I don't know if it will or not, but. You know, the humidity in here, it makes it great. Anyway, I decided I would share this with you. And like I say, I'll leave a link to it below. And uh, anyway, if you're in a warm place, go swimming. If you're in a cold place, find a warm place to go swimming because it is cold here. Um... And if you can't find a warm place to go swimming, snuggle up with someone and stay warm. Okay, we'll see y'all back here soon. Love y'all. Take care and have a great day and a great week.